happy Sunday, everybody. Um, hello. <laughs> I'm here to do a product review. I'm so sorry. Every time I do these videos, I always come to you guys with some major low energy, but that's because usually I'm running around all day, and then I finally, when I finally have time to sit down to do this, I feels like I just got hit by a truck. I feel exhausted. Um, so I'm sorry again if I seem a little low energy, but I'm here to do a product review. Um, so as you know, um, I, I don't know how to, where to start this, but <laughs> so I've just recently, um, uh, like the last two months or so, I've come to, um, understand and appreciate the importance of deep conditioning my hair. And I've found a deep conditioning product that I really like, which I've mentioned before. And it's the uh, Canty Shea Butter for Natural Hair Deep Treatment Mask. Um, I love this product. I love this product. Um, but I decided that I wanted to, you know, go and, and try some other deep, deep treatment masks or deep conditioners um, for two reasons. One... Um, this is like the first one I, I actually ever really tried and I really, really like it. And I don't know if perhaps, and this is a rel relatively new uh, product from my understanding. So I don't know if out there there's other products that are like this or better than this. So I definitely wanted to look up, look around and, and try some other things. And the second reason is that I am definitely afraid of just relying on one product or brand because you never know if you know god forbid like the, the this company goes bankrupt or they discontinue this treatment mask or maybe they even change the recipe um i don't think that you should just rely on just one product or brand because if you do and one of those things happen then you're kind of you know you end up being screwed and you're in, back to square one so for me given the fact that i've just got it into deep treatments for me it was just it's really important to go around and try some other um products to see how they work for my hair so that being said um i came out i came to this by accident the deep treatment mask i really wanted to try first um when i decided i wanted to start doing them um is this by shea moisture it's a very popular brand shea moisture raw shea butter deep treatment mask now this is something that, I'm sorry, I'm a little parched. I'm sorry. So professional. Anyways, when I went to my beauty supply store, no, I went to Walgreens. Um, they were out of this. And what they had instead was this. So I went and bought this and I loved it. So when I ran out of this, I only have very, very little left. I went to Target and I found this product. And it wasn't very expensive. It was like $10. So I went home and I tried it. And um, one, one of the things I learned is always read the instructions on a product before you put it on. I did not do that. Normally when I put on my deep treatment or a deep conditioner, I, I like things to be simple as possible. So how I personally like to do it is I like to put on the deep conditioner either the night before um, or the day that I wash my hair before I wash my hair. Um, call me lazy, but I don't like the, the idea that I have to even wash my hair, get out the shower, put on the deep treatment mask, wait for 30 minutes, then go back into the shower, rinse it out. For me, that's just like too mu too many steps. I'm lazy. So the way I like to do it is to just put it on my hair, leave it on overnight, um, or do it early in the morning before I actually go and wash it out. That's how I like to do it. And I've done it with, with the Cant too, and it, and it worked fine. It, you know, it didn't say here that I had to like um, have my hair washed before I put it on. Um, so I did the exact same thing with the Shea Moisture, and I didn't even read the instructions, I just did it. And then the next day, um, when I, I washed my hair, um, well first I rinsed out the product, and immediately, 
when I woke up the next morning, one of the things I, I, I immediately noticed how dry my hair felt. Um, it felt very really like a clay mask, very clay, which I was like, oh, well, you know, I left it overnight, so that's just natural. So I go in, I rinsed it out, and it rinsed down in a very chalky consistency, which I it was it, I, I didn't didn't like, and my hair felt very dry. So I go ahead and I wash my hair and I put in my conditioner and I, I rinse it out and I get out of the shower and was not a fan. Did not like how my hair looked. My hair looked frizzy. It looked dry. And I'm like, why is this product so popular? It didn't react well to my hair. So I go pick up the, the jar and I read it and I realize I had put it on incorrectly. So what the instructions are here is that... um that you would section your hair, section clean wet hair, apply this product generously. Um, you would use a wide tooth comb to distribute, distribute evenly from roots to end. You can leave it in for five minutes um, or you can leave it on for 30 minutes and you would like put a plastic cap on your head. And then you would rinse the product out. So I, I realized maybe the reason why I didn't go so well on my hair is because I did it incorrectly. So yesterday I tried it again and I did as as what the jar instructed. I washed my hair, I sectioned it, I applied on the product, left it on for 30 minutes and I rinsed it out. This product did um it it did um a better job than the first time. Um it's still kind of a chalky kind of a residue when you're washing it out I don't know um, but my hair did not look as dry as it did the first time I applied the product um, it definitely did look moisturized but it didn't um, I can't find the word but it, it didn't I don't want to say produce but it did perform that's the word um, it didn't perform as well as this product and for me my this is my my measuring stick. In order for me to, to really like a product, it either has to perform at the level that this performed or better. Unfortunately, the Shea Moisture did not do that. Um, you know, it you know it, it was it was nice, but it, it just didn't wow me the way my Cantu did. Um, I still have quite a bit left. I hate the smell. Ooh but whatever. It doesn't stay on. Um, I do have quite a bit left. Um, so I will try it, you know, I'll use the rest of it. Now, is this something that I would buy again and, and put in into my arsenal of hair products? No. Would I buy this? I would buy this if I went to, uh, if I went to a, a store and they had, they didn't have any more of of this available and this is the only deep treatment mask available then yes I, I would buy this if that was my only option but it's not so um, I'm going to try it the third way I'm going to try this is I, I on Chromart I ordered a um, thermal heat wrap it's a cordless one um, you ha it has these gel packs that you heat up in the microwave then you start into this heat into this um, wrap and then you put it on your hair the the cap um, and it's like a cordless you know it's it's yeah it's basically cordless it, it's kind of like you when you use your hooded dryer um, oh and it's it no it's it, it reminds me of you know when um, you take a hot towel and you put it around your head that kind of thing but it's more effective I haven't used it before. I've heard a lot about it, so I, I ordered it from Cormar, and I'll end up using that with this. And I'll definitely will review the thermal head wrap. Um, I also ordered from Cromart um, another deep conditioner, and it's called um, Eden Body Works. Um, shoot, let me let me type it up. <laughs> I don't remember what the oh Eden Body Works uh, Jojoba and Manoy deep conditioner uh, that was also ten dollars um, so 
that's another deep conditioner that I heard a lot about and I will try and review and hopefully it's a plus um, so yeah anyways that's my product review pretty short by my standards um, so have a nice evening. You know, let me know what you think. Um, let me know if you tried the Eden Body Works. Um, oh, let me know of any other deep conditioner or deep treatment mask that you guys have tried and liked. So far, I've tried the Cantu Shea Butter one. I've tried the Shea Moisture, and I'm going to try the Eden Body Works. So if there's any other deep conditioners out there that you think you guys you think I should try, let me know. And like always, like, subscribe, comment. And um, have a blessed evening. Bye.